Y'all, we back at Home Depot getting some more flooring. The grind never stops. We're at it again. I think we need, um, gonna grab us about a good 12 boxes to have so they can be sitting. They have to set and they have to um, get themselves uh, room temperature at the house. Okay, how many do we have? That's 12, okay. I think, I think, you think that's good? 12, okay. Okay, we got 12, now we need to go to plumbing and we need to get some plumbing things. We have a list of things because we ran into some plumbing issues, guys, as we begin to uh, tear down the kitchen uh, flooring and sometimes you gotta move the flooring. Uh, Neil, can you tell them what we're doing with the flooring around the kitchen? Well, we have to go into the dishwasher, so we have to raise the cabinet up a half inch. The whole center island where the sink is, it's all gonna go up a half inch. These are things that you may run into as you begin to do your projects. And um, as Jeremiah put the, how, how do you feel? How does that strengthen your muscles when you're lifting these boxes? Let them know, are these boxes heavy? Are they, are they lightweight or? Are they comfortable? This is not for the week, y'all. This is some really some good work. And don't y'all think we ain't got somebody else on deck. Look who's peeping through here. <laughs> uh, <laughs> all right, guys. Keep following us. Keep watching us as this begins to unfold. And we will get back to you. Um, as we go to plumbing, now we're going to go pull some parts over there. We're headed to plumbing now. We're going to pull some parts for the kitchen zinc. Headed to plumbing. Looking for some parts. Look at these guys. <laughs> Xavier decided to take a break from walking and get him a ride on the cart with the flooring. Are you doing like a, um, a frit, like a fritz of pine dishwasher? Don't they usually do three eighths compression? Yeah, I'm going to get it. Quarter? All right. Uh, I'm shocked by the quarter inch supply and I got the thing and I'm going to need a 90 uh, toilet supply line braided. What do you mean 90? That's three eighths. Yeah, right there. Yeah, 90. Like with the, the shut off already built into it or what do you mean? What, 90? That's because I need 90 to go to the dishwasher. Oh. For the toilet? I'm going to use the toilet <laughs> supply line with a 90 on it for the dishwasher. That's what the guy told me. Alright. Um. <laughs> My little guy's just enjoying himself, y'all. He's got his tab and he's just enjoying his trip hey, to Home he, Depot. What you got? Okay. I mean, that's down there, but then this. He said that's going to be. He's going to put that on the shock bike. This is going to go on the shock bike. Yeah. And, and go to the dishwasher, just like you're doing with that, but it's just, a, it's just the shortest one, the 12 inch. So it's right there. All right. Um, so that, that line's two hours over, so let me get you drunk while we walk over there. They're pulling parts, y'all. Oh, yeah. That's three eighths, so it's not a quarter inch, but I mean, if that size, that's it. We don't, we don't need the shut off. We don't need the shut off. Well, I, I don't really have it in the switching from shark bite to compression line like that without the shut off in there. Okay. Um, uh, compression would be, it'd be way, way okay, more so money we'll just than get just this. getting that shut off on it. Shut off. Gotcha. Um, and then the line two hours over this way. Okay. Gotcha. Ready? Oh, yeah. and put on uh, Small let me, thing you got. I got you. Let me grab the putty and then we'll go down this okay. way. Okay, thank you very much. Grab one right here. Look, my man. I don't really 
have it like that, yeah. minus, you know, with a shut off in it. That's why the braided one is in it. Then you bend it, or you get, like, that piece that I had there, um, that original one. That screws onto the bottom of the dishwasher, and then it comes out with the 92, one of these. Um, but that's, that depends on what you guys got going here. But if, if we're going off the list, but the, I know, but the, uh, Dishwasher. Yeah. Straight down. Yeah, that's that uh, that piece that's usually on there. Is it like a full size actual dishwasher? Dishwasher? Yeah, it's got that three quarter guard hose thread on it. Everything. Yeah, so that piece you screw it onto there on the bottom of the dishwasher, and that gives you the three eighths. It goes to your that side over to the shut off. Oh, that'll go to three inches. Yeah, it goes to that side. Right, so yeah. We'll do that. But then you said you're going to do that, like a, you're going to do a half inch hose instead of half inch. Uh, it's just a one big supply. Oh, gotcha. So you're going from that. Gotcha. So, well, there's the hex is already under there. We were just getting something in case it's a little short. Gotcha. All right. Um. So in that case, we can get you that elbow. And then this and that, and then that will get you get to, to connect it to that half of the pack. Yeah. Um, the only the other option for that is get rid of that pack line and where it goes into the shut off like that. The one just usually use like a five footer supply line to it, and you just go all the way to the actual shut off with the braided you know, line. It's usually how it's done. But since you ran packs all the way to there from that shut off, yeah, it was our, this is already existing, so I'm just trying to gotcha. Connect it onto there, then yeah, you need the adapter to switch it over to the half and sharp bite to there. Um, the, sink, the sink screen is over here. Or? Yep. All right, so we'll get those, and then we'll go back over there. Get that elbow, then. and then that will. <laughs> so, this will be the line to go from that three eighths to this three eighths, and just that elbow screw to the bottom of the dishwasher, and that should be it, right? Well, we probably don't need that. If I well, put that other ninety on. There. Well, that has the male thread, so you need to go from that to this. So you need something to connect those two together, which would be right, this short? is the shortest one I got. Yeah. Four, five, from three eighths to three eighths. Because usually Levy usually got like the five footers and the ten footers, and all right, that because right. they run this all the way through. The then, actual then, I need, then I need something else if I did that. One. Yeah. <laughs> so unfortunately, we got kind of the standard go nine, 99 percent of seats. Use that one. I got the deep well here, the easy lock, which I hate, but this is good old fashioned the one that everybody uses. Whatever you want. This one. Good old fashioned one. Everybody uses. Yeah, man, Works for me. Ninety nine percent of faucet sinks. All the parts already in it? Yep. Yeah, there ain't much to it. There's a, a nylon washer and a fiber washer. Um, put it on top there, put it on top of where the sink part is. And then that's really it. All right, let's go back over there and get straightened yep. out. So we'll head <laughs> down this way, take left two over. You can just wait at the end. That will go onto the bottom of the dishwasher. You take that nut off and screw right oh, okay. there. So and then this guy, the right to that. Yeah, you can cut the line shoulder. Yep, that's it. So that'll go on dishwasher, line connect, that will go on to the pecs. That's it, you got the putty, yep, you got the putty, the two straighteners, and that's, that's it, right? Thank you very much. And Tyler, we want to say thank you very much for helping us pull our parts at Home Depot. Made our experience that much better. We really appreciate you. Thanks, <laughs> Yeah, we got you guys. Thank you so much.